Hi, my name is Gerhard Schwein, and welcome to Selling Power TV. Today, we have the great pleasure of meeting with Puyan Salehi. He is the founder and CEO of a wonderful company called Scratchpad. Welcome, Puyan. Thanks for having me again. Good to see you. Tell us what's new and exciting on the horizon. Up until this point, we've primarily solved for account executives and the folks on the front line. So customer success, account managers, account executives, um, sales development folks, sales engineering. And what we're really excited about today um, and that, that we're working on going forward is taking that same level of attention that we've given to how salespeople work um, and putting that attention to RevOps and how might we be able to help RevOps in the, in, the, in the work that they need to do, but ultimately in the work that impacts the folks on the front line. Um, so we're introducing a whole new suite of tools um, collectively under what we're calling Scratchpad Studio. It is built specifically for RevOps um, to enable them to do all of the work that they want to do. But today, there's just too much friction standing in their way. So can you describe a typical day in uh, someone in revenue operations before and after you implement your solution? You know, one of the big challenges that we've seen or we've heard from a lot of folks in RevOps is the goal is to try to unify marketing and sales and customer success and bring those together so that they work better together um, and each one is more effective. But the tools that they have at their disposal and the, the way at their disposal and the way that they're able to implement things, there's just a lot of friction. And what we've done with Studio is say, okay, all of the things that you wanted to accomplish, you still can, but they're faster now. And so we've given a whole new suite of tools that help RevOps folks with implementing new methodologies, giving their reps a faster place to work that they actually want to, improving collaboration. And the feedback we've gotten so far has been like, why was this not around earlier? Because um, again, it's not that it's letting them do or letting RevOps folks do something radically new. It's what they've always wanted to do, except they have a, a better way of doing it today. So in other words, the, the customer success manager and the salesperson and the marketing person uh, can go on Slack and uh, coordinate fast. What we're introducing now, though, is there's a suite of tools, like I said, under Studio that is for the RevOps person. So one of them we're calling Role Designer. So we're giving design capabilities and power to a RevOps person to say, you know, my mid-market AE team sells differently than my enterprise team, and which is very different than, let's say, our commercial team. And a RevOps person can now actually go in and design frictionless workflows specific to that team or that role that they're going to love, but then it still interacts with the same system of record in the database, which is Salesforce. There's another component that we introduced called cards, right? So as you're changing new methodologies, as new product features are released, as you're ramping people, how do you get sales enablement and sales playbook content to the reps at the right time? There's another feature for that now. Um, automations is another big one, right? We hear from RevOps folks all the time that, you know, the, the data is the, the data's not clean. There's hygiene problems, methodology problems. And we've introduced an entirely new automation system where as a RevOps person, you can go in and set actionable alerts. So opportunities that are out of date, um, when handoffs need to happen, um, end of month cleanup, anything like that, you set the automation, it can go to Slack, it can go to email, it can go to Scratchpad, and instantly the salesperson can remediate it. Right, so we've connected action to the automation. Most people were buying individual tools for Slack or like Slack bots to automate this stuff. We've just rolled it right in, right? So we're trying to simplify the sales stack and make it better all at the same time. So what you're saying is you you are assembling those different tribes that normally are separated into one nation, one place where there's something in it for everybody. That's like, okay, I get right. it. This is for me. Right. But here's the thing that I feel like is has has really lacked in the market is um, everyone has has thought okay Salesforce is the place to do that. But if you really look at how people are working, even today, most leaders have a Google Sheet or an Excel sheet that they're using. So we're in the camp where we believe it should be. We think uh, we think Salesforce has a ton of flexibility, a ton of power. Um, we just think there was something missing, right? And that missing piece is an easy way for me to work with that data, navigate it, bring all of these components together. Uh, and that's what we're calling the workspace. Um, it's just now for everyone on the revenue team instead of just the uh, just the folks on the front line. 
Where can people learn more? Just scratchpad.com. We'd like to keep it simple. Um, so if you go there, we're, we're, we'll have lots of information on this or, you know, I'm look me up on LinkedIn or Twitter, reach out to me directly as well. I'm always happy to chat. Um, but yeah, if you, anyone in RevOps, uh, we're excited for you to take a look and, uh, and hear your thoughts. Thank you, Boyan. Thanks for having me.